The first thing you'll want to do is locate your backyard baseball folder, which should be inside of your C drive, inside of HE Games. It should be labeled Baseball 2003. Then you're going to go ahead and open up Backyard Baseball uh, by double clicking on Baseball2003.exe. You'll find that a uh, window should pop up for Backyard Baseball. And what we need to do first is just create a new coach. And you can call it anything you'd like. I'm just going to do Jim's team here. Press done. Uh, it doesn't even matter uh, any of these pieces of information. You can just click the right arrow and then once you get to that team screen you could just back out and leave the game and you can exit out backyard baseball this will create a uh, backyard baseball coach file and team file i assume that's what the t stands for uh, but the coach file is going to say like c and then a number and so what we're going to want to do is grab the um, the coach file we want to replace it with which is in this case the jibbo uh, open coach file um I pop back in let's grab um the file here and we're going to pull it onto the desktop just so i can easily see it i'm going to now do something i'm just going to rename it from the jibbo tour whatever it is to uh, baseball 2003.c and then the numbers of the coach file we just created with that random team so zero zero um, I'm just going to then pull this into my folder and replace the old one. And if we go back into Backyard Baseball into Season Play, you'll see that the team has changed. And if I click into it, I have all my custom players. They all look like uh, Tony Del Vecchio. That's okay. That's like what they look like if you don't have a uh, player that exists in, as a Backyard Baseball kid or an MLB kid. Um, you can see that I have all the crappy players now. Um, okay, that's about it. Then you just uh, play your game, and when you finish, you can uh, take a picture or a screenshot of the box score, um, as well as the stats page. You can also print out uh, or create a PDF of the stats page, if you know how to do that, and email it to BackyardSportsCenter1 at gmail.com, and I'll submit your score uh, to the standings. Uh, if you want to play with a bat circle, uh, which is the shaded circle that kind of indicates where the ball's going on a pitch, uh, you can do that by going into the coach file and changing the uh, value that says uh, no batting circle to a zero instead of a one. Other than that, uh, don't tinker with the coach file too much, because that would be cheating. Uh, so everyone have a great day, and I'll uh, see you out on the field.